it's that time of year we're getting organized. In today's video, I have some easy dollar store hacks you can try to save a ton of money and get organized. So let's go. I'm here at Pop Shelf, one of my favorite dollar stores for organizing. Let's see what we can find. There's so many fridge organization items that you're not gonna find at Dollar Tree. For example, this is like a pullout bin for $5. There's also several down here, like you have a water bottle organization for $5. There's like a Coke storage bin. I like these for snacks and an egg container for $5. I love this organizer. It has three sections in it. It even has the grippers on the bottom. It's acrylic, it's $10, let's organize with it. Now I thought this would be perfect for Tupperware storage just because it's pretty big and it's going to hold my Tupperware. One of the easiest ways I have found to store my Tupperware is with the lid. That way when I put it away, I always have it and it's in one place. So get a larger acrylic container like this. Then you can just stack up all of your Tupperware containers with the lid. These are here. And then the smaller ones you can put in the front. That way when it's in the cabinet, it's not gonna roll around. And when you go to put it back, you're gonna have a spot for it. There's so many kitchen organization products to make your life easier. This is one that I just noticed, you guys. I haven't seen anything like this. This is an in-sink dish drainer. You can put it in your sink to dry all your dishes so they're not sitting out on your counter. This is a great item to put at the bottom of your sink. If you don't like keeping dishes out drying on your countertop, just place this in the bottom of your sink and then when you're hand washing dishes, you can set them in there to dry. If you don't have a lot of space in your kitchen drawers, try out these collapsible measuring cups. They're gonna save a ton of space. Look at all these adorable storage bins they have here at the dollar store. This one caught my eye, you guys. It's a multi-storage bin. It's really pretty, almost like a blush color, and it has a lid. I have a great hack for this. So I'm not a fan of seeing my Alexa sitting out on the countertop, so I thought, what if I put this in a container? Another idea, you could put routers in here, extension cords sitting on your desk. That way you don't have to look at all of those cords. So I'm just gonna place it down in here, and you can see there's a handle on the back and a handle on the front. I'll just put the part that plugs into the wall through the back, plug it in, and then I can put the lid on top and you won't be able to see it when it's sitting out on my counter. Check out all these cute bathroom organizers from these adorable vanity trays with the mirrors. There's also a makeup brush holder that I think is adorable. So many different acrylics to choose from. You guys, I just found the best deal for the new year. This is a reusable hand soap container. It comes with a glass bottle and eight tablets, which makes it so eco-friendly. You can reuse them and you're gonna have eight different, pretty much bottles of soap for only $5. I think these are such a good deal. I can't wait to see how the soap smells and they're really easy to use. Take off the lid, fill it up with water, leaving about an inch at the top. Then you're gonna place one of the tablets in and it's ready to go after 60 seconds. Just put the lid back on and you have some foaming hand soap. If you've made it this far in the video, thank you so much for watching. Comment the word of the day, which is organization. On Amazon, I show you guys a lot of reusable, eco-friendly products. Well, they have them here at the dollar store too. Like these reusable wipes. These are kind of like your reusable paper towels. They also have our Swedish dishcloths in these really cute patterns for $5. And it looks like you're gonna get a three count. Another item I was really drawn to, they have all these natural brushes, but look how adorable that one is for $4. If you're not happy with Dollar Tree raising their prices to $1.25, here at the dollar store, you can pick up several items for just a dollar, like the brooms and their mop heads. Dollar Tree has these dryer balls that are $1.25. You can buy them here at the dollar store for just a dollar. You can put these in your laundry to replace your fabric softener. I have a cool hack to show you to keep this box organized. 
You can do this next hack with any box in your pantry. So open up your box and then to close it, you're going to put one of the sides and fold it in. Then with both of the smaller sides, fold in the flaps. Next, you're going to take the sides and pinch them together. Now with your last flap, you're going to tuck that in to the other side. See exactly where I did that? Push it down all the way and it's gonna hold in place. I just spotted this magic brush here for $3. Now it says it's supposed to remove lint and hair from your couch. I wonder if it'll live up to the Chom Chom, which is $20 off of Amazon. Let's see how well this magic brush does. So I wanted to compare the Magic Brush to the Chom Chom. And I have to say both the Magic Brush and the Chom Chom do a pretty good job of picking up lint off of your upholstery and especially on your rugs. When I used that Magic Brush on my rug, it picked up a ton of lint. I would say the difference is, is it was a lot harder to take the lint off of the Magic Brush than it is with the Chom Chom, which stores all the lint in the back. I would say overall, I prefer the Chom Chom but the magic brush was definitely an affordable option you may want to try. I have a hack idea for you for all those reusable bags that we like to keep in our cars. Get one of these clear organizers here at the dollar store, fold them up, put them inside, and they'll stay nice and organized and not all over the place. If you have a bunch of bags like I do that take up so much room in your car, get a container like this and you wanna fold them up. You can fold them into rectangles or squares. Really, it doesn't matter how you fold them. Just try to tuck in the straps whenever you put them into your container. It's that time of year where we're all wanting to get organized. And here at Pop Shelf, they have so many cute journals and organization tabs. Let me show you some of my favorites. This is one that I've been using since, I think our first time coming here was in the fall. It's a to-do list where you can map out the things you're doing in the morning, the afternoon, and the evening. It's just a great like daily to-do list. They also have ones where you can create weekly to-do lists. Don't skip the beauty section when it comes to organizing. I have a hack you can do with these hair clips. So I have a crafter's hack that I really wanted to try on my yarn. I have this whole bucket of yarn and sometimes it'll kind of come unraveled or maybe I can't find the end of it. I saw this hack where you can use a barrette hair clip to put on the end of your yarn to hold it in place. I find once you get to those smaller balls of yarn, this is a great hack to do. These travel containers for a dollar definitely caught my eye because this one has a pump to it, which makes it so much easier when you're traveling with lotions or things you need to pump out. So I definitely am gonna pick one of these up. How adorable are these toilet brush holders for just five and $10? I would love to know what area of your house you need help organizing so that I can plan future videos. Thank you so much for watching. And if you're new here, make sure you subscribe and I'll see you in our next one. Bye.